funky. My darling, I love you, 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 called Bella. I will let Bella tell you a little bit about herself, her business and her kind of experience and styling and then you're going to see me in outfits that should actually suit my body type and make me look a bit more trendy than my joggers in a top. <laughs> so this is Bella. Hi everyone. I don't know who's more excited if it's, it's me or me. <laughs> We've been texting each other and I've been like I'm so excited just put me in colour make me look cute. <laughs> I'm really excited to style you today. So obviously um, I have been working as a personal stylist for the five past years and right now I've got my own company called Style by Bellas and I dress, I can dress anyone for anything and um, that's what we're going to do today. Yeah, so I will have Bella's website and Instagram linked below if you're going to a special occasion and want to style or you do like wardrobe declutters mm -hmm. and revamps yeah. as well because I've seen that. So if you're like me and literally don't know how a pair and I would fit together, it would be really good to get into contact with Bella because she could revamp your wardrobe for you. Um, and I've seen you do like wedding transformations for yes, people. So uh -huh. if you're going like to a special occasion, I'll definitely be contacting you when I get good events because yes. I am the biggest stress head about an event and what to wear. So I'm really excited to see what we've got to do. We've got a variety of stuff, mm -hmm. haven't we've we? From a lot today. yes, we have. <laughs> we've got quite a lot of outfits. I really hope you enjoy this video. Video. if you do please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and also check out Bella's socials which will all be linked below yeah let's go and get the first outfit on okay so outfit number one is on Bella really likes this one and so do I I really like this outfit so we've got a lot of colour I love it yeah I think it suits you so well what yeah. was your inspiration with this like meal drinks picnic in the park mm -hmm. yeah yes um just like a summer day just yeah. for anything you can dress it up and dress it down yeah. as well definitely yeah How do you feel? i really like it so probably not something i ever would have picked if i was in the shop because i'm very particular i've already told bella this but i'm very particular on like floral patterns but i love this the colors on it are beautiful like you've got yellows is that like red, orange, yeah. pinks? And I think the fit of the dress is it's so cute. You. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if the camera's shown for length, but we have got some, what brand were these again? They're Carbella. Yeah, so we've got some of their white trainers, which I really like. I was telling Bella I'm definitely more of a, what do you class it as, like, Casual, casual shoes. Yeah, casual yeah. shoes more than sandals and heels and stuff. So I like that this is dressy but cash. And then we've got a little tassel bag which is super cute. Yeah. I love this. I really do like this outfit and I could see myself yeah. wearing it. Yeah, so I'm gonna will we rate them? Will I rate them? Yes. 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 I think for out of my comfort zone and something that I know I would wear, I would give this one an 8 out of 10. Mm -hmm. That's, That's good. good. That's that is good. good. Yeah. Okay. Really good. And I think it's so interesting because I never would pick it myself. No. But being just put in it, I'm like, oh, oh. I think with this print, it can look a bit like curtains. Yeah. But if you put it with cool bag and cool shoes, yeah. it makes it trendy and it's like a whole different vibe. Yeah. That's the thing when I've been speaking to Bella, it's for me it's finding what you do with these prints yeah. that i struggle with because i think i said to you before that sometimes with floral it can be curtain looking yeah. but when you style it you can make it look good but for me it's hard to find what to style it with yeah. so i'm really really happy with this one we're on to a good start <laughs> so we will go and get outfit number two okay guys so outfit number two is on I'll give, let Bella tell you her first opinion. I, I don't know about you guys, but I'm in love with this. When I saw Demi step out and this, I was like, eee! Oh, yeah. I just think this is like such a cool city outfit. Yeah. Like it's modern. And you were saying that you were a bit unsure about... Yeah, my dad clothes. doesn't make me stand on here, so I'm just <laughs> going to show you. So you were saying that you were a bit unsure of your yeah. ankles. Yeah. Making them look big. But yeah. I think when you've got something like this, that is quite floaty and it's quite wide yeah it's actually making your ankles look smaller yeah rather than a pencil yeah. skirt where yeah. they're accentuated because when i had my consultation with bella one of the things i said i didn't wear was long skirts yeah. because my probably least likeable area on myself is my legs just because i think they're quite chunky for a girl so that's what i'd kind of said to bella is i don't wear 
long skirts and you were like I'm gonna get you one <laughs> um, but honestly with the pattern of this I think it does look cute I love it never it's something I would have no. picked but I, I do like it it's weird yeah I to do. be honest when I picked it I was like she's either gonna hate this or she's gonna love it yeah I love it on you and yeah you could always this you can just roll up the sleeves a little bit yeah just as a little detail as well yeah and i really like i don't know if you guys can see but this t-shirt actually has a slogan neckline as well as like a slogan print which i love slogans i really mm -hmm. do think this is pretty but it's the pattern on the skirt as well never would like have gone for this if i was going to wear a skirt i think it would have just been a black one but this is just yeah it's really really different but i'm not mad i'm not mad at it i think this one I would rate 7 out of 10. So still like it, but I think I prefer the dress a bit right. more. Okay. But yeah, not mad at this. Okay, so outfit number 3 is on. What's your inspiration for this one? So I think like polka dots are everywhere right now. Yeah. And there is so many different variations, like the skirt for example. And I think these are just so easy to wear. Yeah. And you can dress them up as well. Yeah. So I personally love, love, love culottes. Um, and this outfit is a bit of me. I love it. I love the culottes and I love the pattern on them as well. How it like really, like you said, you could dress these up or casual them down yeah. with a t-shirt. So this t-shirt's actually just got a little red slogan, Levi. And red's my favourite colour. So this is just such I a love me. The, like them yeah. together. It's really like looks quite retro. Yeah, yeah, it does. It does. This is such a me outfit. Like I actually love it. And these colours fit so nice. Like cinch you in a little bit. Is that yeah, what it's called? Yeah. yeah. So they like got such a pretty fit. I love this outfit. This is probably my favourite. Mm. Um, and this is going to get a ten out of ten. Mm, this, so excited. yeah. <laughs> this is definitely because I think I'm used to wearing cloth. Mm, yeah. I feel a lot more like this is me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> The other outfits I love, but it would take me getting a bit more yeah. used to. But yeah, this is this is a huge success. I love this. Okay, so outfit four. four yeah. <laughs> yeah, outfit number four. So as you'll see, you've got the same pants on, but this is styled up, isn't yes. it? With this, what is this called? It's like a little mesh. Yeah, Puffy sleeve. I love these right now. There's so much like mesh and like organza right now, and it's just so on trend. And I don't know if you can see, but there's little, little polka dots on this one as yeah. well. Yeah. So it could be a set, but it's not. But yeah. I think it looks fab together. Yeah. So I'll just show them a little closer up image of like there's like mesh polka dots and then this has polka dots on it as well so like Bella said this could be like a little cord yeah. and then we went with a pop of colour bag haven't you just to bring something to the outfit now I really like this I think this is an outfit I have still got the white shoes on but I think I could potentially wear this with heels yes, like for like a meal and drink yeah. something like that so yeah I really like this outfit because my favourite ones <laughs> are featured I think I would rate this one 8 out of 10 mm -hmm. yeah. I really like it do you think if you would it's, have a heel, you would feel Yeah, like I think if I had a heel, yeah. I would feel more glam with it. And yeah, but I do like it. It's just not something that I probably would have picked towards that getting used to it again. Yeah. But yeah, this is doing so well. We're having yeah. such a successful like styling session. <laughs> <laughs> Love that. Okay, outfit number five. So this is definitely a bit of me. I personally have tried to style things like this before, but it's never worked out. <laughs> and it's not something that I would say is kind of in my wardrobe as a go-to, but I love it. Uh, honestly, when you stepped out that door and uh -huh. it, I was like, wow. That's I good. love the colour on you, especially yeah. with your eye colour as well. Right. And I think the fit is just fab. Yeah. And we'll just put this little belt to kind of cinch in the waist yeah. even more. Yeah. And then I've got this little jacket for cool. you. Cool. Now yeah. I never really wear jackets like this. Um, so this is like a new concept of a jacket for me. I love this. I think that's, this looks so cool. Yeah. I love, and I love the contrast of the black and the like sage green. Yeah. I think this is like a tr on trend. But kind of, what would you call this? Like is it all... Uh, uh, what style is this? I'd say quite minimalistic. All right, minimalistic mm, style. The, um jumpsuit is so plain cuts. Yeah, uh, it's actually from a brand called Monkey. Yeah, um, which is a Swedish brand, and yes. I've never I've heard of them, but I've never tried them They're before. They're very like plain cuts, simple, and then I've got some really funky prints as well. Yeah, but honestly, like this is so pretty, and I wish you could feel the material of this. It it's so, so soft. This, I'm gonna rate this nine out of ten. That is good. I'm yeah, really happy with that one because. 
It's really out of my comfort zone in terms of the style of this, but all put together, I love it and mm -hmm. definitely would wear it. Okay, outfit number six. This is quite an out there yes. outfit. We didn't quite know what we thought of this one. Yeah. We were just like, hmm, it's quite <laughs> interesting. See, I love the print of it. Right. And I think it's like, it really shows your tiny waist here. Mm -hmm. And I think it's quite funky with the sleeves yeah. as well. Yeah, I've actually just said to Bella, the sleeves on this are quite different to anything I usually wear, but I like them. I do. Um, and now this is a very in your face print, isn't it? Like, if I'm in this, I want to be noticed. <laughs> it's quite a um, statement. Yes, it is. Very statement. It's very modest as well, how it's quite high up. But I, I'm not mad. I think this is a cute pattern in a, a quite a cute fit and dress yeah, as well. It's actually like small bananas and like banana leaves. Oh wow, I didn't <laughs> even click that on. Oh my god, yeah. So I think it's quite funky. Yeah. And this one is from H&M. Yes, and this was probably one of the ones you were unsure about. Yeah, I wasn't sure. I was like, either she's going to hate this or you're going to love it. Yeah, so, I do. I think I'm in, on the fence with it because I could definitely wear it, but I think it would take some getting yeah, used no, to. Definitely. Yeah, I think it would rate this one probably 8 out of mm -hmm. 10 because I love the pattern. And I love the arms, but it would take me like I would need to get used to yeah, this. <laughs> but I do love it, I do. I think it's cute, and the bag kind of separates yeah. it a bit, doesn't yeah. it? It gives it that thing. <laughs> I really like, yeah, what's it called? Contrast. Contrast. <laughs> That's what I was looking for. But yeah, I do like this, it is cute. Okay, guys, so outfit number seven. This is probably the first one I'm a little bit less liking. <laughs> yeah. I think for me, I think the fit of it's quite nice. Now, I would wear boob tape for this. Um, but I don't have any on it but I think it's more the patterns quite in your face and I don't know I just not sure if it's something that I would reach for in my wardrobe I think it's it's okay yeah maybe for a holiday on the beach but I think the color is actually a bit too close to your skin tone yes the background color so it's not as wow as the other bits has been yeah so we're gonna give this uh yeah I'm probably gonna give this one slightly lower mark I would probably say maybe a five I think that's a pretty it's good not bad though. yeah I think I would wear it that's why I'm not giving it low because I think on a holiday Probably going to the beach or something on, yeah. i would throw it on 100 mm -hmm. but it's not something that i think i would reach for a lot no okay so outfit nine eight eight eight, eight. eight. i eight. think we're eight yeah. <laughs> okay so very in your face color i'm in love with this color on you yeah i think it just goes so well with your dark hair your green eyes yeah and your skin tone yeah and i love the the square neck cut mm -hmm. of this lengthwise it's not usually a length of dress that i would go for mm -hmm. i think the longest i ever really go is just past my knee mm -hmm. so it's quite out there in terms of length and style but oh, you've got a little slip there yeah and I yeah. think that just makes it a little bit younger, a little bit trendier yeah. as well. No, I agree. I really do. And you could style this so many ways and with so many other items. I like it. I do. Probably not one of my favourites, but it is something that I think I could wear yeah. once I got a bit more used to this style of it a dress. Is, it is quite like a lot. It's like poofy sleeves, it's a neckline and yeah. the colour. So it's quite a lot at the yeah. same time. Yeah. But it's lovely. Yeah. So we have used the same shoes for all of these outfits. Yes. And that's the way Bella likes to style, isn't yes. it? I don't like to have a lot of things. I like to have a few things that goes with each other. So you don't have to have a packed wardrobe of stuff. Mm -hmm. Just like a lot of things that you can mix and match really easy. Yeah. So we were actually talking about this previous. A lot of the time you can have so many outfits with one thing as your main focus. But yeah. you compare it with different things and you, like you see, make so many different outfits from it. So yeah. for this one, I think we're going to rate it seven mm -hmm. i do like it but i think the length's giving me a little bit of like a grandma vibe no honestly yeah you can i don't know if if we take it out of them loops we can actually rule it up fold it up yes. yeah yeah mm -hmm. So you can play around with it. Yeah. I do like it and I think if I got used to wearing longer dresses, it's a style that I could potentially wear. Mm. But I think just like mentally I'm not there yeah. yet and I'm like, ooh. <laughs> okay, like, so I think this is outfit number nine. Yes. Yes. Now, probably my least favourite and I think you're not too Same. fond of it either. For me, I think the fit's just not really the most flattering. Mm. I, th I thought when I picked this one for you, I thought we're gonna love this yeah but actually now when it's on you it's a little bit dark for you yeah it's a little bit dark and it's not actually showing 
you, it's, I don't know, it's just not the most flattering. Yeah, not sure. what you envisioned this no, one to be. It's quite a straight fit, actually. And you thought it'd be a bit more yeah. cinched. Yeah, I'm the same, I'm in agreement. I think it's just got a lot of, like, I don't know, like, I just don't think it's the, the nicest fit. So, I think it's quite long here as well. Yeah, yeah, the crotch is, like, I don't know if I'm really small that <laughs> way, but it, the crotch is quite a lot, isn't it? Yeah. I think this one, I'm probably going to give a low score. Probably, yeah. like... Mm -hmm. Three. Yeah. I mean, if I was like, I'd rather wear it than be naked, but I probably wouldn't wear it. Um, I don't think it's a one that I would pick. No. No, just not. I think, like you said, the colour and just the fit, just not, not, right for not working. No. But, but you know, it's a yeah. good envision getting a bit of animal print going. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. Okay, so outfit number nine. So this was my wild card. Right. Basic white trousers can sound quite scary. Yes. And I think the fit on you is really nice because it really shows your waist. Yeah. And the white is just really crisp and you can always put it with different tops for well, like any color really. Yeah. I think we would have paired it with like some strappy heels or so just something yeah. a bit dressier. Yeah. Yeah, I think my opinion on this outfit is the white is a lot for me to take in mm -hmm. because I'm not a white bottom type of person. No. I think when I was younger, I had a white pair of jeans and then be like, that was it. So it's a lot for me to get used to, but I think on a holiday on setting, holiday, yeah. a white's a really nice colour to wear. And like you said, they do cinch in, so yeah. I think they can look really nice. I think I'm just like not used to them. No. Well, as I said, it was my wild card. Yeah, so it was like, a wild yeah, card. I love it. Yeah. yeah. I think they're really fresh on you, like crisp. Yeah. I'm not mad at it, and I think I would rate it probably a seven. Mm -hmm. Because I could, I would wear this outfit with some nice strap heels on a holiday. Yeah. Definitely would wear it. It's just a lot to get used yeah. to. Okay. So this is the next outfit. Very summery. Very summery. Yeah. I think we were a bit unsure of it because you were saying that you associate this top with someone yeah my mom so my mom wears a lot of tops like this so as soon as i seen it i was just like that's something my mom would wear not something so i want to wear it's really cute on you when yeah you, like took it in like that with a little bag and we've got little bits of yellow in it just like the bag as well i think it's really cute but if you don't feel comfortable yeah i think it's not something i would wear purely because i think the floral and this style of top is very me ma'am and i don't <laughs> want to be dressing like a 50 year old yet sorry ma'am love you but <laughs> so i think personally because i know she'd wear this top yeah. it makes me not want to wear it right so i think i would probably give it a lower rating yeah. but on a holiday you know even this with a pair of white pants and yeah. heels on a holiday could I look pretty yeah with the white pants yeah and i kind of took it in with the real yeah ones. yeah um i think i'm gonna rate it probably about a seven right. i don't hate it but i that don't love it yeah yeah because yeah. i think i could wear it but it's not something out of all the outfits it's probably not one of them that i would yeah. pick and go for <laughs> but still good I'm not, i don't hate it okay we've lost track of our number of outfits but this <laughs> is our last outfit what's your inspiration for this one so i want to get quite a vintage boho feel yeah. on this one this one is actually from a new look yeah but i think it looks like you picked it up from a second hand shop yeah in la or something like that yeah and then we've just paired it with this like rusty little camisole and the fringy bag again as you can see we're reusing a lot of things yeah. in the outfits in so many different styles you can wear yeah. them personally i think this would be so nice on a festival yeah. the only thing i did say to bella is this type of top i don't think sits too great on my top half so i think a more fitted top would be something yeah. i'd preference but this style of an outfit is definitely something i would wear at a festival yeah. um and i like the little fringe bag and i love this this is like giving us that boho vibe yeah, that i want i like it yeah i think this outfit i would probably rate it about an eight that's good and that is yeah i really do like this outfit and i love it, this it looks really like effortless on yeah you. it's like you haven't really made an effort but you've made an effort yeah, <laughs> yeah they'll be like oh where did you get that from <laughs> yeah definitely i really like this outfit okay guys so this is going to conclude my styling session i've really really enjoyed it i think it's been really interesting to put things on that i would never have picked myself and just see how the look yeah. and i think i've definitely got some things that i'm going to keep mm -hmm. and i'm going to be stable in my wardrobe so yeah wh why did you want to style me so when i first saw a picture of you yeah i think you were wearing like the loungewear yeah um, the like just a bra and your knickers yeah. and i was like 
oh my god who is this who is this confident young woman i was like i need to dress her <laughs> and that's how the idea came across yeah and i obviously i dress women every single day and men and what I do is basically give them that confidence. Yeah. So that's why I wanted to dress you. And I think it's been really successful. There was one or two outfits that weren't my vibe, no. but you, you're going to get that. You probably get that with yeah. most of your clients. You're not, not going to love everything. No. Yeah. But I think overall, it's been really successful. And like I said, definitely got items that I'm going to be keeping and use. will see on my Instagram because I'm going to be wearing them. So I think it's been a really successful video. And I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. And maybe if people are watching who are a similar body type to yeah. Yeah, no, they'll be like oh I've never tried something like that but I'm gonna now try yeah. it because I've obviously tried it on so every item we've showcased throughout this video is going to be linked below in case you are interested in anything we'll try our best to have links to more I think a few bits might have been from Primark obviously we can't link their items yeah. because they're not an online site yeah. but I will state in the description if it's not linked where it's from so you have a reference of that and please do make sure if you want any style and tips you go over uh, Bella's Instagram and if you want to talk to Bella maybe about getting a award wardrobe um what do you call it a wardrobe uh, revamp <laughs> yeah like a wardrobe update yeah now, if you just want a style change i also do a wardrobe detox service where i basically go through your wardrobe and kind of help you put pieces together and maybe fill gaps where it's needed yeah and also if you've got special occasions coming yes. up you're probably perfect person for any wedding things you want yeah. and yeah, so I really do hope that you have enjoyed this video and a very new concept on my channel, but I hope you have enjoyed it. And if you have, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you very shortly for another video. Bye! Bye.